Cabo San Lucas update from your favorite real estate team, Cabo One, BK Cabo. I'm gonna show you guys, of course, some of the best deals, some of our newest listings, and some pretty big price drops that we've had come up here as well. In Cabo San Lucas, or in Cabos in general, August, September, these are considered our slow months. For a lot of brokers, a lot of people, a lot of agents, they actually take vacation during this time. At Cabo One, we actually double down and start working twice as hard. Why? Because everybody else leaves. That means we're the only guys left. So last September, when everybody else left, we killed it, just like we did this last month. 19 properties, 16 sold, where everybody else is crying. You know, we are moving forward, baby. And that's because we got that hustle grind mentality. Damn. Damn. You like this how windy out. Does that look good? Imagine this. <laughs> cool. Sure, good. Huh? You got, what do you think? Because you found that. Raise the five? I didn't. I Raise the five? What? I, t I told you. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Stutter, stutter, I stutter. told you. Let go. Stutter, stutter, stutter. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Number one on the list is Villa Besame. We have had two fallouts on this due to one, the buyer not having the funds that he said he had, but he turned out to be just a. <laughs> Number two, NFL. Hall of Famer superstar, cash in hand, ready to buy the property. The problem is, is that I couldn't show the property because it's always rented. But that was a bummer because this gentleman really wanted that property. You know, his loss is your gain. So this property brings in right at about $30,000 a month. And here's the kicker. So we've dropped the price down now to 4.49 million dollars and we'll accept 70 percent financing and we'll carry the 30 percent over three years if you just take it out of the three years the balance comes out to about forty thousand dollars a month well the property brings in thirty thousand dollars a month so really basically you can have your renters pay off the loan for you and keep in mind that this rent does not include the casita you could rent that for an extra 60 grand a year as well you can get into this property for 3.1 million and then let the renters pay it off for you for the next three years that combined with the typical property in Cabo San Lucas has an appreciation of 15% and this property is even going to be higher than that because with a tiny little facelift boom it's 7.5 but if you're just talking about your standard appreciation in three years you're looking at about seven million dollars without doing anything to the property. This is a absolute steal and you need to jump on this. I'm gonna post a link to the full video for this property. Next, and as you can see, we got that Cabo One Real Estate Mafia merch. We got some new hats, some new shirts. What I'm gonna do is the first 10 people who comment in this video, if you're in Cabo San Lucas, well, I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna drive over and give you that new hat if you would like it, the new shirt, whatever you guys want. And if you guys are from out of town, I'm going to mail it to you. So first 10 comments, you guys can have some free merch. This is no cheap stuff. We don't cheap out on anything, only the best for Cabo One. Coronado, 3.4. Out of all the Coronados currently listed here in Kavira, if you don't know Coronado, this is a single level Santa Monica style home, four bedrooms, has one of the biggest pools in all of Coronado, one of the biggest personal pools in all of Kivira, has the jacuzzi, it is the newest property available. So it has all of the updates, all the goodies. People love Coronado. We've rented Coronado to Aliman, Cedric the Entertainer, a ton of celebrities. There are no Coronados left. There's like three left, they're all in bad locations. This Coronado has an excellent location, excellent view of the ocean. They opted in for all of the upgrades. This is a picture of the map. As you come in the back row here, you're up at the top, you have nobody behind you. Some of these other ones in the middle here, they're kind of blocked in, right? They're too bunched in. So this is what is called a transfer of rights. So what does that mean? That means you are buying the contract from the current owner and the current owner actually got in at a lower interest rate than the actual developer right now. So you can take this property over for 1.3 million and then assume his contract. That means he has, I think, one big payment and one other small payment and then 10 year financing at 7.5%. That is very rare in Cabo San Lucas, 10% financing for 10 years on the balance, on the 50% of the balance. And obviously, any of these properties that you guys wanna view, you can message myself or any one of the Cabo One members and we can show you these properties seven days a week anytime that you would like. The only thing is with the Villa Besame, it's rented often, so you need to message me ASAP so that way we can get in there. Next up, this is a new listing, and this is a very, very cool listing with a ton of opportunity. This is located about five minutes outside of Todos Santos, absolutely gorgeous. It has been renting for over 20 years, has three structures, three properties, on the property itself. So this property is right at 1.85 acres, three buildings on it, and has a total of 11 beds. The pictures don't do the justice, but this is something that 
could be out of a movie scene and it is kept up so well. I mean, it is perfect. I mean, I wouldn't wanna overdo it probably, but you literally could put another 60 townhomes out there that would all have like two stories with an ocean view, unblockable, maximize your ROI massively. But this is traditional Mexican style. This would make an awesome rehabilitation center. I mean, it already is generating income just as a hotel, but this really could be turned into something gorgeous. The pool is gorgeous, the jacuzzi is gorgeous. So all this kind of land back here, this is all part of the property. And you could build townhomes here, all facing the ocean. Like big two-story townhomes would be awesome. You could do 80 of them if you wanted to. This is not actually part of that property, but this land is for sale. So if you did wanna buy this, which is actually beachfront, it has another home on it as well. Basically the whole thing, you know, gonna be somewhere around 4.5, and that would be awesome. Copala, this is an Alvar Copala Villa. And this villa has more upgrades than any I've ever seen. First off, the Alvar model is the best model. So not only, obviously, it's Kibera, you get access to all of the other Kibera amenities, you get the golf, you get access to all of the other six resorts, Polonito Sunset, Monte Cristo, Pacifica, the adult-only pool, the adult-only resort, rather, free shuttle service, I mean, just in Copala alone, six pools, plus your kiddie pool, plus the gym. It's a four-bedroom, has a private swimming pool. Of course, it has a spot there for your golf cart. On the outside rooftop deck, we have a jacuzzi with a beautiful ocean view and then a city view at night. In the back here, we've got a nice big swimming pool. We've got a man cave area. We've got the Weber grill. We've got the secondary sink. We've got the TV. We can be watching football from the swimming pool, chilling, and the doors open up all the way. So it has a very big floor plan. And actually, you can see the colors. I'm painting it right now. I do that sometimes for my clients because I say, look guys, we can make you more money if we do A, B, and C. So I'm painting the entire thing white, I'm doing a couple little accent walls just to show people you know, what it could be. But I'm making this into a fresh canvas for somebody who wants to come along. Doing that as well as just adding a couple little upgrades, meaning I'm putting a fireplace in the bottom, kind of like the one that I put in my house. Somebody's gonna be able to come in here and just do their own style to the home. You've got one master bedroom on the ground level, and then you have another master up on the top, and then you have another up on the upstairs with a view as well. And your number four in the back is actually the only one that would be kind of facing the park. Something else very unique about this property is both of the master bedrooms have a bathtub. So look here, this is one of the masters here and has the window here cut in with the big bathtub here. You're chilling in bed watching a movie and you know, you got your, your lady there just taking a bubble bath. For me, that's comfort. Put in a real sauna, which not too many people have. If you guys don't know how good a sauna is for your life longevity, you need to watch basically just a video by Dr. Rhonda Patrick. She talks all about the benefits of sauna and jacuzzi, and of course, ice bath as well. Here's a nice aerial shot here where you can see you've got the jacuzzi up on the roof. You can see the den here in the center. You can see all three of the bedrooms that have the nice view here. Down below, you've got the pool. You've got your man cave here, and you've got your sauna on the left. Now on top of that, We've also got a generator. This is about a $40,000 upgrade. So let's say power goes out. Now here in Kivira, we don't typically have problems with power, but if it does go out, he can run his pool, his sauna, his jacuzzi, all of the air conditioners, all of the lights, every single thing in the house on full blast for four days straight. That's pretty dang impressive. Of course, if that happens, you're not gonna be running everything. He probably could, you know, run the basics for two, three weeks. It automatically clicks on and automatically clicks off. Like, you don't have to do anything. The other upgrade was the water filtration system. You didn't get the little cheapy, cheesy one. He got the bad boy, the one that just takes out everything. That was like a $5,000 upgrade as well. Then he's got the sauna. So there was a big upgrade as well. Of course, the pool, huge upgrade there. And then, of course, the jacuzzi, giant upgrade there. And then they did the hurricane shutters. Big upgrade there, the outside bar with the barbecue, the Weber, the outside TV, just upgrades on upgrades on upgrades. This is Copala 5307. This property, I feel a little bit bad on. And it's because it's so nice that I didn't think I would need to promote it that hard because it's just a stupid deal. Like it's an amazing, stupid deal. And I kind of just thought it would sell. And it, like I had so many showings and nobody pulled the trigger. I don't know if they made a mistake. I don't know if I priced it too low, but yeah, I mean, this property is gorgeous. Again, tons of upgrades. Has the jacuzzi here, has the built-in Weber, was never Airbnb, has a view that is to die for. I mean, this is the view from the balcony. Now here's the view from the master bedroom. 
and the view looks right out, boom, directly, perfectly to the ocean. Also has tons and tons of upgrades. The nice wood beam pillars throughout the entire living area, upgraded light fixtures there, gives it that really homey feel. Also has the upgraded tile, upgraded granite, has the full L bar, and you see how they extended the cabinetry all the way to the rooftop? That is awesome. You don't see that very often. So it actually has taller, more cabinet space. Also, when you open the cabinets, it has drawers that you could pull out. This was all upgrades. And the other thing that I've never seen in any of the other properties is it has three princess balconies. One is you first walk in to the left, has one off of the number three, one off of the number two, and then it has your terrace in the front. So, or your balcony in the front, rather. Of course, you get the Q-Life. And if you don't know what Q-Life is, that means in Kavira, we are a family. We are a very close niche community, unlike, for example, Diamante. I had a conversation with a friend. I said, do you know anybody from Diamante that lives there full time? And he goes, no, I don't. I just know people that go there for a couple weeks or, you know, people that use it as a slight vacation home, you know, second, third home. I know people who live in Carencia full time, Palmia, Perial, but Diamante, kind of strange. I've never met anyone that lives there full, full time. Whereas in Kavira, we have tons of people who live here full time. So we have a great community. People play pickleball every single morning. We have a, a Texas Hold'em game pretty much weekly. Now, also, we've got our new website set up. If you're wanting to purchase property in Cabo San Lucas, all you need to do is go to our website. The link is gonna be down below, cabo1.com. You can go ahead and search through for properties. Go to property search here, and you're gonna just start scrolling out and checking out all the different properties. And we've got a few other really cool parts about the website. Maybe you want to make some extra cash. Maybe you want to work with Cabo One. We'll go here to the tab and go to the partnership program. What you can do here now is scroll down, send us a little bit of information, and you can start actually earning some cash working with the number one team in Cabo San Lucas, Cabo One. People are always asking me, how do I get into real estate? How do I become a part of the team? This is where it starts, right here. You become a partner with us. You show me what you can do. And if you actually do what a lot of people think they can do, I'll put you on the team. And I've actually also been thinking about having a tryout. You send me in a video saying why you'd like to become a part of the team. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take four people. I'm gonna choose from as many videos as we get over the next couple of months. I'm gonna fly you out here during high season. We're going to film tryouts. Whether it's four people, it might be eight. I haven't decided yet, but you're gonna be living here. We're gonna put you up in a nice villa all of you, and we're gonna film some tryouts and make this into a very fun, cool thing. And if you got what it takes, well, then you can come out here and you can make the big bucks, live in paradise, and become part of the Cabo One team. So go ahead and you can send those videos off and you can do that right in the partnership program page. So this is 7504 for a two bed is the second nicest I've ever seen. The first nicest would be a penthouse that is coming up, but there's gonna be a lot more money than this one. For the money, for an entry point into this community, you're not gonna find a nicer property. These pictures don't do the justice. Never airbnb never, it looks brand spanking new. And the owners did an excellent job. I love all these chandeliers. They're the nice modern style. So these cabinets don't go all the way up, but they did soften it off really nice. Where like other units, my unit for example, it just kind of sits there and collects dust. So I actually would like to extend and go all the way up kind of like the other one did. Tower seven over tower six and the other towers actually has the newest granite. As you can see here, has the same granite that they put in Coronado, that modern style. And that's a big, big plus because the granite is not easy. To, if you want to change it out, it's extremely expensive. So it's nice having that there. And if you look here in the bathroom, they did full size mirrors, which I also love. When you compare that to all of the other properties, they do not have that. This one has the pillars here. And then this is the view right there from your principal. The ocean view here is gorgeous. Looking out at the 16th green at the Jack Nicklaus Signature Golf Course. Full-size mirrors here in the principal bathroom. This is another one of our listings. This is 301, perfect arch view with financing. Priced at 598. This is a three bed, three and a half bath corner unit. The view from this one, well, go ahead and take a look spectacular. We have two units over here. These are really modern units. So when you compare these price-wise versus your Copalas or your Vista Villas or something like that, they're priced quite a bit less. And to be fair, you know, we are comparing apples and oranges. This person that purchases this property over here 
wants a little bit better price, but also what they like is that arc view. A lot of people really love that arch view and they want to be closer to the swimmable beaches. Whereas in Kivira, we don't have a swimmable beach. We're on the Pacific side. It's a little bit cooler. It's for people that really like more the pool. And you can see here, it has nice, beautiful accent lighting, indirect lighting in the bathrooms. It's newer. This uh, property, I think, was built just a few years ago. It's more spacious, much wider. And you can see the style is more modern as well. Gorgeous property, especially at this price point. We have one more property in this one here. This one is a uh, number 309. And this is also a three bed, three and a half bath. Every room has its own ensuite. This one is decorated just a little bit different. I would say the other one, this one has a beautiful accent wall here. A view from the, this bed I think is actually facing the correct direction. So this one is facing right at the ocean. And this one of course is priced a little bit less. Um, these owners are motivated. They wanna sell it. And this is fully turnkey too. Has a wonderful gym here, two pools, nice uh, common area here that you can use for fiestas. And it's very chill, it's very tranky here. Next here we have Mavilla. This Mavilla two bed is 100% completed. It's ready to move in and it's priced, crazy priced. MLS 333961. Six thread at 1600 square feet. It's a two bed, two and a half bath. And this has a excellent view. So what do I mean by view? It means it has a view of the pool. So like you're looking long ways across the pool and then it also has a peekaboo of the ocean. This is the best entry point into Kivira. You got your $6 million Alvar, you got your $4 million Coronado, you got your $2.5 million Gopala. You're getting the same amenities as those guys for 500K. I mean, that's crazy. On top of that, we've got developer financing. This is a transfer of rights. So we're locked in 10 year financing at 6.7%, you gotta come up with right at about 300K and the rest is developer financing. That is a steal of a deal, guys. We need to sell this ASAP. Send me a message. If you guys want an entry point into Kivira, this is it. In three years, there's gonna be no more $500,000 properties in Kivira. There's gonna be a million and up and that's it. And that's, that's a fact, guys. Mark my words. Everything that I say, always comes true. We have Pacific Bay. It was completely just repainted, has a new furniture, new beds, new TVs, 65 inches throughout, has the really wide hallways, tall ceilings. When you compare that to everything else in Kavira, it's very unique considering pretty much everything else in Kavira is very colonial. At the end of the video, I wanna tell you guys about not only the luxury properties, but a little bit of some commercial land that we have as well. When it comes to commercial land, guys, there is nothing that we cannot do. Just call me, tell me what you guys want, whether it's commercial or whether it's uh, land, we can get stuff everywhere. Why is that? Well, because a lot of my team, most of my team is choyeros. Is, is it like a cookie that you eat? No, it's not. It's a person that is born in Cabo San Lucas. A person that's family is originally from Cabo San Lucas. If you look at this beautiful piece of lot, massive commercial lot here, right next to Walmart for 1.7. Right down here, we've got another giant piece of land next to Walmart. I'm gonna put a link to all these so you can view all these down below. We have another piece of land here, uh, 14,000, basically 15,000 square feet in San Jose. I mean, we've got land on land on land. Right here, we've got like three hectares. And honestly, we've got even more than that. I mean, this is just a sample. I've literally got thousands of hectares depending where you want it. This is downtown Cabo, a massively awesome location. Remember guys, the first 10 people who leave comments, I'm gonna get you a free shirt or hat. Post a comment down below. Let me know what other videos you guys would like to see and your boy will hook you up. I'll see you on the next video. So I wanna play for real money. Okay. So. Damn. Uh, Damn. Damn. You like how windy Does that look good? Imagine this <laughs> pool. Good, good. Huh? You guys, what do you think? Because you don't <laughs> Race the fire? I didn't. I Race the fire? What? I, I told you. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. I told you. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That's in. Yeah, that's one. That's in. That's it. That's two in a row. I have blackjack, how you can surrender. Do you want to surrender right now? Or? You surrender, you get half your money back. You're lucky twice. That's in. That's short too. Ooh. Oh, it's not short, but... Oh, come wow. on. That, that was ridiculous. <laughs> that's got it. That's sure. it. That's in. That's in. That's in. Oh. Two, 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 two. Two. Put these J's on. That's in. I'll just surrender. I'll give you like a thousand. You haven't been that good yourself. So. Yeah, I was without shoes. Yeah. That's terrible. That was super. Oh my god. Uh, put, Don't edit that out.
That's it. Yes. Okay, so that's three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's it. That's in the middle. Damn! Oh, it almost, it Where you go? Close my pocket. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Close my pocket. Yeah, 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 yeah. There you go. No, 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 no. There's no, all no, of no, it though. Okay. Alright. There you go. We'll spend it all in one place. <laughs>